What's up, y'all? Welcome to Grabbing Through the Bay with me. We took it down to Vallejo to D Boys Grabbing Dough. Um, it's a local comfort food. So I tasted a little bit of the mashed potatoes and gravy, the mac and cheese, um, the shrimp tempura, um, fried chicken, and rice with uh, the curry sauce. And that was pretty good. So I kind of, on my way here, was deciding what kind of combos I wanted to try. That kind of thing before a loop, because now I'm like, man, what do I want? <laughs> it's pretty good, though. So still thinking but we'll go ahead and, and see what it is so i got a little taster test here some greens i already put some hot sauce on it i got my mashed potatoes and gravy some mac and cheese the rice with the curry a little piece of chicken and some shrimp tempura so i'm gonna go ahead and just taste test a little bit i haven't decided exactly what kind of combo i want yet but it all looks good so i'm Super juicy and super excited. Let me hit a few screens first. Oh no, I crossed it up already. I had some hot sauce on it already. I think I want some uh, macaroni and cheese. I don't know if it's comfort food. So I don't know if I want to go so food yet or if I want to try like the garlic noodles with the shrimp. So we'll see. Mm. Okay. It's a little, it's, it has garlic in it. The, mac, um, the uh, macaroni and cheese. That's different. Then. Let's check out this mashed potato with gravy. Try that one more. Let me hit it one more time. They're big on comfort food, definitely comfort food here. Macaroni and cheese and your mashed potatoes to show. Now, I'm not really a fan of curry, but we're gonna go ahead and try this. See what it do. That's good. It's not like super strong, so like I think I might have to try this. But then again, I do like rice with gravy too, so. Whoops, we'll see. I don't know. Oh my god, I can't decide. That's JT. That's JT. That's JT. All right, so I'm gonna get, I went ahead and chose the shrimp and I got some garlic noodles up under there. And then I got the short ribs, fried rice, and the greens, so, so excited. And then I got the ribs, ooh. I don't even know where I'm gonna start, but let's just get into it. Here is and then to wet my palate, I got this is the hood drink. They got cactus coolers, this is orange pineapple blast. So we gonna try that. I ain't never had it before. I guess it's a native to Vallejo area. So let's see what that do. Go ahead and put it over a little bit of ice. That's him. That's him. All right. So I gotta put me some um, hot sauce on my greens. I'm over here trying to figure out how I'm gonna attack this food. So my taste test, I did not get the garlic noodles or the fried rice. So let's try that. Oh, it's so flavorful. Mm. 
the normal fried rice, got the eggs, looks like got carrots, um, green onion, definitely taste the soy sauce up in there. Mm. I'm gonna try these garlic noodles. I'm gonna bake it too. Mm. Can't go wrong with the garlic noodles, baby. Now I'm over here thinking about what my next combo is gonna be the next time I roll through here. <laughs> mm. I love me some seafood, so let's go ahead and see what the shrimp be, what the shrimp be like. And she was saying that all their sauce, that all their sauces are in house, so they make all their sauces. This is the lemon caper sauce. They make that. She said it's gonna go good with my shrimp, so I'm gonna try the shrimp just by itself, and then I'm gonna go ahead and dip it in the sauce. So we'll see what that do. Super bomb. Y'all see all that garlic on there? Him for sure. So flavorful. Mm -hmm. That lemon caper sauce is good. They have salmon too. She says they, they got to get it whole. Cut it up. Um, for the um, salmon, but that would be good for the salmon. It was good on the shrimp too, but the shrimp by itself is just fine. It don't even need the sauce. And y'all know how I like my stuff sauce that yeah, I did need it for that. Mm. These are adobo greens, and I've never had that before, but it's definitely good. It's a different flavor than like you know your regular country greens but it's super good especially with the hot sauce mm. i'm over here plotting y'all don't even know <laughs> i'm trying to make sure i capitalize on everything Also, I know these ribs are about to be super, super messy. So that's why I'm trying to like, mm, let me see what I'm going to do. Man, I want to know why the South Bay ain't got these. We need to, I'm going to go ahead and hit up all the um, liquor stores and be like, y'all need them cactus coolers. So they're good. Hit this rice again. It's pretty good. So. And she said they make the teriyaki sauce and it has um, oranges. I think she said they put oranges in there. So I definitely want to try that. Let's put this short rib with this uh, teriyaki sauce on time. I want to be managing use my hands. Y'all know me. This plastic cutlery don't, don't be doing me justice. I be trying to get it in my plate. Try to keep it as ladylike as I can. This sauce is good, y'all. It's like teriyaki sauce. Mm. But look at these grill marks on there. All right, I gotta slow it down. So good, though. Mm. So. I learned a little bit about this um, this restaurant. It's like a co-op. They have um, a lot of different vendors that promote their items in the store and then other um, restaurants and stores promote them. So they do have uh, someone that's selling like kettle corn, someone that's selling honey. Their desserts come from um, someone that makes the dessert. I'm gonna try the um, ube flan later. 
excited to try that. I keep going back to these dreams because they are so good. All right. Let's go ahead and get into this rib here. Ooh, look at this. Falling off the bone, baby. Can't be mad about it. Actually, perfect. Four quarters in Cleveland, the border shot 36%. Mm -hmm. Two quarters here tonight, they're shooting 38%. They, you can get on the It's like a party in your mouth. So y'all was gonna get messy, but it's super good. The meat is just falling off, just how it should be. Tender. I skip. Try with some more of that. Uh, where's my teriyaki sauce go? Mm. Most of their sides are vegetarian, so that's cool. Try my ribs with my brains here. Mm -hmm. These are some prawns, baby. Garlic, they're so good. I told y'all I don't need the sauce, but let me just hit the sauce one more time just so I can, you know, taste it. But the rest of them will just eat by itself because these are pretty good. Super flavorful, just sweet, not fishy at all. Great flavor. I like that I have some other sides to go with it, but honestly, the shrimp and the noodles together is perfectly fine. Some thick old noodles too. Probably all of my things. Try these ribs one more time. Mm -hmm. I think my favorite side right now would have to be the greens. The fried rice is pretty bomb too. Shrimp is banging. I like the flavor of the um, short ribs, even without the sauce is good. Um, these are just like I said, just off the bone, tender, falling off and everything. I'm gonna go ahead and um, mash the rest off camera and I'll come back to y'all in just a moment to let you know the full 101. I have Dennis here, he was the d and boys. Let us know about your establishment, how long you guys have been here. Uh, we've been here about um, eight months. Uh, we opened on March 23rd. 3 23, 23. All right, that's tight. <laughs> so I enjoyed the ribs. I had the short ribs. I had um, 
the fried rice and the garlic noodles and the shrimp. It was all smacking. My favorite was the greens and the shrimp. Bomb. Um, I'm gonna try my ube flan in a moment. We'll see how that do. I'm gonna definitely put it in a box to go. The rest of the leftovers that I do got, I smashed them up all of it. I got like a couple of shrimp, <laughs> a little bit of the noodles left, but all my greens was gone. <laughs> Most of all that fried rice was gone. So the rest of the little bit is gonna go ahead and go in the box to go with me. Taste that a little bit later. <laughs> Thank you so much for having us. Definitely we'll be back if we ever come back up to the north. We'll be out here at D-Boys and see what else, catch what else is gonna be on the menu. Again, it's a variation, different days you have, you have different meats and stuff. I've seen on IG, so check to see what they got for the day for sure. But God tier, y'all know I don't ever give a tier of God tier, but this is God tier for sure. Smack it. Oh, and the, um, the, the sauces are made in-house, so you can definitely tell the elbow grease is up in there. That is, it's left all the way through and through. Thank you for having us. Till next time.